So today we're going to test ramen noodles with my blood sugar monitor. This is going to be interesting because it's filled with a lot of carbohydrates from these noodles. So let's give it a shot. Okay, it's been about two and a half hours since I've eaten the ramen and I am back home now. Let's check the glucose monitor and see what happens. And this is really interesting. I started eating my ramen at one o'clock. My blood sugar levels started to rise as I was sitting at the restaurant. Then when I left the restaurant, it took me about 25 minutes to walk home. This is remarkable for me because it not only stopped an insulin spike from all the carbohydrates in those noodles, but it actually lowered my blood sugar. That moderate activity lowered my blood sugar. And this is even more interesting. Then I came home, looked at my monitor and sat down for a while. And you can see it started to rise again as I was sitting. So I decided to get up and do some more activity. I went for a walk, I did a little laundry, and lo and behold, look at this, the blood sugar started going down again. So the big lesson for me today, if I ever eat a high carb meal like I did, I can always go for a walk to minimize that blood sugar spike. That is truly phenomenal.